Hello, good morning, and welcome to Loving Life at 60-ish. And as I've said before, you don't need to be 60-ish to be here. Um, it is just what I am at this current time in my life. And I'm just happy that you are here in my journey. And I hope you're loving life also. Now, with that being said, not everything is always rosy and happy in my little world, but I do try to look at things on a positive note, so to speak. So today I'm here to show you um, a Disney album that I have done. And it is, I would like to say that it's finished, but they're always in the works. Um, these were from, the uh, pictures you'll see are from when my kids were younger. And they liked or was were willing to stand in line to meet the characters in Disney. Uh, now, when we stand in line to meet the characters in Disney, luckily I have a grandson who likes to do that. But otherwise, the kids only do it for me. Um, because I like to stand in line and meet the characters. So this is just my little take on an autograph album for the kids. And like I said, the pictures were taken quite a while ago, but I've just finally uh, gotten to the point where I am finishing up the albums. There are two here, but you will see that, um, I mean, if I show you inside on the first page, you'll see that they're very similar, um, although one starts with Mickey Mouse and one starts with Minnie Mouse. I didn't really notice that, I guess. Oh, but then they just swap. So anyway, um, I see what's happened. This one starts with Mickey Mouse too. I just skipped a page. Um, so I'm just gonna show you one of them. These albums, the scrapbooks, were from, Hmm, what company were these from? You know, I don't know. I would have to look it up. But like I said, I, you can see I just finished some pages in the back here. And I need page protectors. So this one is my son's for someday when he decides he wants to take it to his house. And like I said, my, my kids are adults now, so they both have their own homes, and um, but we still enjoy doing this. So I'm going to show you, this one is my daughter's, it's Tinkerbell, and let's see. So I don't have the loose pages back here um, that I do in my son's, and I can't remember... I'll have to see if these match what's in the back of there to show you. What we do is we take index cards with us. And we have the character sign the index card. We still do it this way with my grandson. I have made him one album. I'm in the process of doing another one for him. And this obviously is Mickey Mouse. I think everything is in the frame. Yes. So I, um, I, I take index cards, or I think this particular year I cut up white cardstock, and we took it in a little um, plastic pouch with a, um, some Sharpies, and that's how we did it. And then we just had pictures with the characters. This one is... Minnie Mouse. And Goofy. I wanted to check in my son's to see if I did Goofy the same way for him. No, see, I did them a little different. So I'll, I'll do my son's also. Um, I don't think, I can't fit them both in the thing. So I'll do my son's quietly at the end. This was the uh, Finding Nemo area. I would tell you what year these were, but I can't remember. Um, 
but my daughter's 30 now and my son is 27, if that tells you anything. So this is the Finding Nemo area. And I was blonde then, and I really am not blonde. I've got very dark hair. Donald Duck, who is my favorite all-time guy. The Evil Queen, or The Queen, as she signed her name. So I just cut these white card stocks into tags. Excuse me, Willow, what are you doing? My One of my little dogs, she's misbehaving. I just cut it into a tag and then made it into a tag, tied some uh, fibers to it. Pluto. Peter Pan and Wendy Darling. So they signed one tag and then they also signed another tag. Now, here's the other thing. Um, we, they had separate little pouches to have their cards signed. Some people, some characters weren't thrilled about having to sign twice. Most didn't mind at all. So that was good. Belle, she was very fancy. Snow White, even my husband got in the uh, picture for this one probably much to his dismay. <laughs> uh, Cinderella. And Susie and Perla. I don't know if they're out in the parks anymore. I, can't, I haven't seen them, but I haven't been a lot. Tigger. Now this was a sticker and I pop dotted it up off the page. Pooh. Pocahontas, again, my husband got in this picture. And it's actually Pocahontas and Miko who could sign his name also. A lot of the stickers are Sandy Lion and what's the other one? Oh, EK Success, Captain Hook, and Smee. Geppetto, Gideon, and Pinocchio. So we got to see all three of them, Geppetto and Gideon and Pinocchio here. Oh, no, Pinocchio here. And that's the end of those. Let me see what how this one... Yeah, yeah, so they're very similar. Um, so Snow White, that is definitely an EK Success sticker. And Finding Nemo was already in there. It's just simply that I need some more pages. The Queen, I was going to see, oh, she's holding out her hand right here because my daughter and son were chewing gum. And she made them put their gum in her hand. How gross is that, right? But it was funny. And there I am. That's one of my favorite Disney pictures is with the evil queen. And then Peter Pan and Wendy Darling. And Mr. Smee and Captain Hook. So these are all... Um, now, this was only one year, and I've still got several more years to do but obviously I'll have to get new scrapbooks and Pocahontas and Miko and I need like I said new page protectors so there's that I'm also going to do a video of I'll, I'll do the um, Tinkerbell one and I'll do it without any chatting at all so I will just um, turn the pages and if I can figure out how to add music, I'll add some music and you can just enjoy it that way too. Although this album is not, this video is not going to be very long, which is nice. So there is a, a way to do an autograph album that you might like. And um, like I said, some of these papers and stickers may no longer be available. Um, this was a patch, it wasn't even a sticker. 
was just a sewing patch that I had picked up somewhere. But there are still loads and loads of Disney uh, stickers that you can get. Okay, I will try to link anything down below that I can. This one was a Sandy Lion album. Ah, good to know. It's right there. Uh, made by Disney. Uh, San made by Di Sandy Lion, but uh, Disney trademarked. And like I said, I'm not sure about this one. It just has a UPC code on it. And actually, this doesn't even have anything anything to do with Disney on it. It's just the colors were perfect. It says Frozen in Time, Photographs, Memories, Smiles, Watch the Birdie, Picture Perfect, Say Cheese. Yeah. Okay, guys. I will see you soon. I hope you enjoyed this uh, video of... Uh, scrapbook and what you can do as far as an autograph album and it, it went together very simply it's an 8x8 album I just cut all the paper up to 8x8 added matted the pictures matted the tag well cut it into a tag and then matted it added some stickers and some ribbon to each of the tags. So you can see the top of it has a lot of ribbon coming out. All right, I'm looking forward to doing a new autograph album and I will share that with you. Thank you, have a great day.